next week, so we're slowly getting into that fall like feel. Switching gears on what's going on in the tropics. Currently, there are no tropical threats to the area. We're continuing to monitor Earl, which is a hurricane, and it is pulling away from Bermuda right now, bringing tropical force, uh, tropical storm force winds to that area. It has winds of 100 miles per hour, moving to the north northeast at 7, 17 miles per hour. So the latest track from the National Hurricane Center it looks like it's going to stay a category two hurricane as it pulls to the northeast. And then as we head into our Sunday, Monday, it's going to dissipate as it goes over uh, cooler waters. Again, not a threat to us. Still watching two waves here. One wave over the Central Atlantic has a low chance of tropical development in the next five days. And also a stronger wave here looking pretty good on satellite imagery it has a medium chance of tropical development in the next two to five days there. You can see the hatched area where it could potentially develop. But both of these tropical waves are uh, fighting wind shear. So again, and I popped up the Saharan dust, so we have that dry air again working against it. So they're going to struggle a bit in the next couple of days or so, but we'll watch them long term uh, again. And now it's called Invest 95L. Here's a look at your seven day forecast 86 today and we are looking at hit or miss storms through today.